as I have gotten older, I have decided we really need camps for adults. Understand they already have concentration camps in the United States of motherfucking America that they've been building for four years now. And the question is, who in the fuck is you When the president declared an emergency and it's time to round up all these black folk and put them in some of these storage facilities right. until we decide what we're going to do with them. Y'all, right. why do you think they're building all these storage facilities? Y'all ain't got that much stuff to put in storage. Come on, y'all. Think. Storage facilities were running water. What boxes need were running water? Minority troops divided and detained along with all white civil The virus in the, the, the 60s was a struggle for human dignity and for human rights. The next struggle will be a struggle for survival. And it will not just be limited to black people or black against white, but it will be the poor people, the masses of the people in the country struggling for the right to live, for the right to survive. The neo-Nazi groups in Texas, Louisiana, and Mississippi, along with state militia groups, like the Missouri militia, the Michigan militia, the Minnesota militia, all of these white paramilitary groups that have their training grounds out in the woods and stuff that y'all, I'm sure y'all know about that, right? I hope you know about that. Well, the amendment in 1984 was written to include them automatically being deputized when the president declares the emergency. And all of these other groups will be deputized by the federal government to round up blacks and Hispanics for encampment. We really need camps for adults. Well, you know, maybe mix it up a little bit. You know, you can have the red cabin, the blue I've had cabin. People have calling the... me saying they go out to their mailbox and they find a little red dot or a little blue dot on their mailbox and they wonder what the little red dot blue dot is. Well, it's marking your mailbox by the government so when foreign troops come in here on us after martial law, if you have a red dot on your mailbox, they take you out immediately and shoot you right in the head. But if you have a blue dot, they take you to the FEMA camps being built by Halliburton right now to house 50 million Americans are building enough concentration camps in America by Halliburton that Cheney's getting rich off of, Vice President Cheney's getting rich off of, to put those with the blue dot on your mailbox in those concentration camps. Now, if you go out and you find a pink dot on your mailbox, that means that they believe you'll be a good slave and you're going to go along with the program and serve our international Antichrist masters. I have to come back and tell my people they finna fuck us.